And in today's unboxing, 501st Legion Clone Trooper from the new Archive line. Hello and welcome everybody, Darth Rock, thank you so much for joining me once again. And again, a big thank you to Jason from Middle Age Kiwi Man Collecting Star Wars Figures. Um, again, a link to his channel below. Um, if you saw my previous video, he sent me a package and this guy was inside. And I am truly grateful, Jason, and I really, really do appreciate you sending me this guy because he looks freaking awesome. And as, as you can see, I've got his gang ready. So today, we're going to unbox the 501st Legion Clone Trooper from the Star Wars The Black Series archive line. And I cannot wait. Right, so I'll, we'll look quick look at the box. As always, nothing really much to see there. So um, I'll sort that out, move these guys out of the way. And yet yeah, once again, thank you so much, Jason. I really do appreciate all the love and support um, and everything you guys have ever sent me before. Um, and this guy is just freaking awesome, so. Sorry for the glare, just your basic archive, nice image on the bottom there. And that's the back of the box, those that might like to see that, in that 50th anniversary look there. But the figure itself, damn he looks cool, nice weathering to him as well, just looks good, I like the blue. Blue pops nicely. Right, so I am going to take him out of the box and we're going to have a look. Alrighty, here he is out of the box. Looking pretty snazzy. Um, not much to look at in regards to guns and stuff. It's just your standard, your standard stuff. Your standard blasters. But yeah, how cool does he look? I can't wait to do some photos with the boys as well. Put a backdrop there, it's just so it's not too too white. But how cool! Like I, I mean, I know it's a repaint, likely, but it just looks awesome. It's the little things that stick out for me that make me go wow, like the weathering on the legs in that here. Um, I'll bring in shortly the commander dude because he's yeah, he says a lot himself, but. Let's bring him in closer and let's have a look at his detail. Here he is, but there's a lot going on here. Like he's, there's a lot of dirty. He's very dirty. <laughs> a little bit at the back as well. It just looks awesome. Really, really do appreciate this, Jason. Honestly, this is one clone I actually really wanted, but um. I pretty much told myself I'll probably never have that. Some cool weathering. It looks awesome. And it's the old, um, the older articulation, I believe. See what about that far there. Use your head. And the knees at the back there. Yeah, he looks sweet. I'm going to put his gun in his hand now. Make him look even better. <laughs> cool as. What an awesome looking figure. Another clone. I'm gonna have to. I'm not. I actually thought because when I got this, I was like, man, where's he gonna go? So I actually pondered. Um, and if you want me to, I will do it. Now you tell me, and I will do it. Um, just. I was going to play around with my Clone Wars shelf, my clones and stuff, potentially on a live stream, just cause, have a chat, have a fiddle, how cool is that, look at that, you can stay there, see that dirt on the side of his head, that's quite neat. using that as a comparison to see the detail on it. Look at that, that's awesome. It's just dirt, dirtiness. I love this guy. 
Thank you so much, Jason. Whoops, dumped it. Right, I'm going to pose them up and send them up with some bad boys for an epic ending. And there we are. How cool. Love it. Love the blue. Love everything about these guys. Give me more. Give me more. And Rex just tops it all off. <laughs> oh, how cool. Again, thank you so much, Jason. Um, Middle Age Kiwi Man collecting Star Wars figures. Check out his channel. I will leave a link in the description if I remember. Um, check out the unboxing too because I, yeah, it was pretty cool. It was pretty cool. Sorry, I was just off to the side. I oh, can't see it. <clears throat> yes, Jason, you're a legend. So I'm fiddling now. <laughs> How cool. Oh, I'm super happy. And I got my Revan too. I've actually was in the process of making a, um, like a Sith Dark Side video black series. Um, my top eight, because I have eight. So I will be getting that done once I've cleared some stuff. <laughs> but um, yeah, truly grateful, Jason. Honestly, this is just awesome. He looks so good. So grateful to have him in my collection. Dogs are barking at the rubbish truck. I'm just looking in through the camera. It looks awesome. Right. I don't think there's much else going on right now. No. <laughs> All right, my friends. Thank you so much. Thank you guys for your support. Um, let's see what's around the corner. I recently won the... What was it? Blue Harvest competition. His monthly giveaway. So... I was lucky enough to win that this time around, so that was pretty exciting. Very unexpected, so that's on its way. That's a package all the way from the UK, I believe, so it might take a while, but looking forward to it. And go check out um, go check out his channel as well, Blue Harvest Vintage Toys. All right, my friends, I'm going to stop rambling on and telling you my life story. Um... Until the next one, subscribe to Middle Age Kiwi Man Collecting Star Wars Figures. Subscribe to my channel. Smash the like, comment down below. Follow me on your social medias, all the hoo has. Until the next ones, my friends, give in to the dark side and may the force be with you all.